Chris is here. We got Chris. Chris is safe. I do not believe at this moment we can bring Chris, but we will bring him to the doctor and the doctor will protect him. Hey, Chris, buddy. I think it might be good that you go talk to my researcher friend real quick and make sure you stay out of here because things are about to get a little bit messy. Oh, uh, yeah, no, Blaine told me to lock myself in here. Like, oh, I, I read, I, I had no, and someone like, you might want to cover your ears. It's going to get loud, yes. I don't want, I don't want you to get scared. Of course. Yeah, I mean, you know, I'm locking myself here. Yeah. You know, Blaine gave me a hug, so I feel like that was a good reaction That's good. to my letter. That's but good. I can't tell quite yet. He didn't like ask any questions about it, so it's, it was an important letter. I was hoping to talk more. Don't worry, buddy. I bet you will. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you. Excuse me, I need to do a routine security check on uh, your desk. I've received reports that there have been mask juice vials. Um, if you don't mind. Right, go ahead. There's none in there anymore. I was made aware anymore. of the situation and we turned them yes. into research. I have no idea how they got there. Have you seen my notebook, by the way? People have been... Actually, um, we've found your notebook as well. Yeah. We found it. Um, well, we're back we're again. See, um, what is your name? We'd like to know, site director. My name is classified for security purposes. Are you sure, Charles? Wow. And okay. are you sure there isn't something you're hiding from all of us? Oh. Is that pocket watch supposed to mean something to me? Yes, it is. I'm sure that you have one that is very similar. Used to belong to poor little Charlie. I'm sure there's a familiar face in here who hasn't seen you for a very long time. I have a pocket watch. Wow. What a Yet it is the exact crazy. same. I don't think that there's many pocket watches exactly like this one. Probably not a whole but You're an anomaly. We know. I'm sorry, what? You, what? You should know, this is in my files. It's in your... I, I'm sorry, please explain. My mom's anomaly, so I'm a cat. This is in my file, like my name is right there. Uh, uh, Sybil has kept this from me. Oh, I thought Sybil's Sorry, this is like an important conversation. You know, I think if you're gonna keep denying things, we need you to be a little more honest. <laughs> Look, I don't think I don't think we should uh, be be. No, 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 no. We should be talking. Yes, it's such a carefree I'm day. I'm having a fun time with you right now, but yes. this is very inappropriate during a containment breach. How how much how much do you know about your relationship with the plague doctor? And who else knows? Because I'm sure Elizabeth, your little fling, would be very interested. Oh, you didn't hear? Yes. She broke up with him. What? <laughs> oh, yeah, she doesn't yeah. have anything to do with him anymore. I'm sorry. My, my, not, my! Uh, what? uh, whatever rumor? Yeah. Then, I don't think it would be very far to say is, if we go to her now, we tell her the truth. Why don't we find you a nice little box so you can have a reunion with your brother? I don't think so. Unless you, you, I mean, this is ridiculous. Sus! Are you sure? What, do I look 500 years old? Yes! Hey. <laughs> you that don't is look very rude. Cougar! <laughs> I knew it! Oh. I knew you're a cougar! You look 500 years old to me. Uh, but, well, did you know? I would say. You certainly had a very interesting relationship history. Not just with Elizabeth. We saw the brother. Cougar! We've all found it. You need to tell the site or we tell him the site. It's lining up! I hate this thing. Yes, yes. Listen, David, guess, guess, what? guess what? Guess what? Now is the time you have to do it. David has a hymn of courage. If he reads that before coming over here and fighting you, you need to have the upper hand. You need to approach first. Oh. Okay, hold on. Yeah. Okay. Okay. You have to talk God about damn. your relationship. I know, I hate this shelter. thing. Uh, just give it right. to me. Uh, Come on. So, yes, you're right. Play doctor as well. Imagine having a brother. He killed my entire family. Sounds like a you problem. Oh my god. Oh, that, that was the wrong moment to walk in. That's okay, I think we're gonna walk in. Yeah. Look, 
Honestly, if being related to him makes me an anomaly, fine. But I bear no ill will towards anyone here. I'm just doing my job of securing, containing, and protecting. And what about David? What about David? Did you want to protect him too? Did you care about him? Leaving him to disappear? Like I said, I called for a retreat and he did not follow my orders. I would like to... Listen, I would like to object. I actually read the documents. There was... I'm sorry, but there was a document about the equipment of the class about the teleporter. And from... Oh! What? That's a nice little... David had it. How did you get that? David had it. He seemed to have gotten it from somebody else, but... He's under the impression that you closed him off in the portal, so you can take his lover. <laughs> oh, I'm yeah. sorry, no. You should confront, confront him now before it's too late. Yeah. David might be spreading rumors. <laughs> Honestly. It's such a ridiculous rumor. The equipment request for the teleporter? Yeah. That's for next weekend. That's for Elizabeth's birthday. We found that too. Yeah. And we Signed also. by myself and Dr. Elizabeth. We also Chung found Taylor. out everything through your journal. We found out how much you've been going into this and that. The timing is just too different for you to make such a request. Well, what? No, it's Elizabeth's birthday next weekend. And? So we, we made a, a request for a teleporter. I mean, you could ask for, for what? Well, we're going to a, a wine train in Santa Barbara and we don't want to have to drive, so we're teleporting. So you're procuring site funds for your special little researcher thinking that it's completely ethical. You know, I think the ethics committee would be very interested in that kind of request. All right, fine. Misuse of a teleporter. If that's what you think I am guilty of, I'm okay with that. This nonsense about me trying to kill David is nonsense. If you want to come at me with a teleporter accusation, like, yeah, I'll own up to that. All right, but I'm not. I like, like I said, I am trying to get everyone out of here alive. I bear no ill will towards anyone here. We are just, we just wanted to use the teleporter. It's her birthday. Come on, she wanted to use the teleporter. Okay, I'm gonna go talk to Elizabeth. She will corroborate this. All right. She did. You have the. She did. She did. So she corroborates. But does she know about your anomaly? Does she know how long you've been alive? Does she know about your relationships? No. Okay. Have fun. Please. Keep it on the down row. Hey, Elizabeth. No, it was Adelby. Oh, it's fine. Listen, I think that there's something wrong here. I think actually you're being deceived. We've been doing our own research. I know that you gave us our own assigned tasks, but we have discovered that Charles has been lying to you. Who's Charles? Charles, the site director. We know. His name is Charles? We know that you know. We've seen your notes in that different language. Seen, seen my what? Your notes. We saw your note. Even though we haven't deciphered it, we know that the two of you have been an item. No, no, no. I'm, I'm not with Charles at the, or the site that my sister is. I, I, I just found that out today, but my sister is with Taylor. Yeah. If you've seen any other notes, someone might be. Yeah. We have a question. Um, any other notes? Are there any other notes that's been going on? I mean, someone gave me a note earlier that was from the site head to my sister, and that's what one did of the it say? Why it said they wanted to spice up their relationship. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. I didn't need to know that. Yeah. Um, but I, there's. I I'm going promise to, you, there's okay. nothing going, going to on tell with you. the site head and I. Do not. Don't trust the site head. Don't trust him? Do not trust him. He is lying. What did you find out about him? Well, if you know something, please tell me. Do we tell? I think you might want to ask for yourself. Ask the site head myself? What he's been lying about? I mean, he can be kind of cagey. If I just go up to him, he might... Okay. Go ask Chris. Do you know anything about this? That too? Yeah, do you know this by any chance? <laughs> Give her the truth. I mean, this is my sister's handwriting. Do you know the language? 
No. Do you know who could translate it? It looks like some weird made up language. Do you know who could translate it, possibly? Anyone who might know different languages? I think Elizabeth, it's probably something she made up. So I would ask ask her. Let's go to Elizabeth. Thank you for listening. Site42 Studios and its staff are funded by viewers like you. Please become a patron or visit our merch store at the link in our bio to support our work. Secure. Contain. Protect.